Hi there, and welcome back to Pinch of Cookie. The holidays are here, so let's make these cute and tasty chocolate pine cone cookies. My kids love making these cookies, and I bet once you see how easy they are to make, you will love them too. We start with two sticks of room temperature butter. And to the butter, we add two thirds cup of sugar. I'm going to mix it up a little bit. And to the mix, add a teaspoon of vanilla extract and a pinch of salt. Now we will mix it until everything is fully incorporated and the mixture looks nice and creamy. To this we will sift in two cups of flour and one half cup of cocoa powder. And that's really it for the ingredients. Now we just keep mixing it until it all comes together. You could also do this in the stand mixer with the paddle attachment and it will come together really quickly. Uh, but by hand is just fine. You will know when you are done with the mixture what it looks like a uniform smooth dough that you could easily pick up and mold. Now I will flatten this dough out, cover it in plastic and transfer it to the refrigerator for at least half an hour. You could even make this ahead and freeze it too. So my dough ended up sitting in the refrigerator for several hours. So let's see if I can work with it. As you can see, it is super crumbly. Um, and I can't work with it just yet. So I'm gonna let it sit on the counter for about 15 minutes until it just softens up enough for me to work with. Now it's pliable and I can form a ball with it. So now I'm going to make an egg shape form between the palms of my hand, flatten it out a bit, and you want one end to be narrower than the other, just like the real pine cone. Then put it on a flat surface and make diagonal cuts with a knife across one way. You want the cuts to be equal distance and cut not too deep, but not too shallow either. And then come back and let's make the cuts the other way. This already looks like a cute pine cone. So go ahead and make the rest of the cookies. Now, after you finish baking all your cookies, we're gonna bake it at 350 Fahrenheit for 15 to 18 minutes, depending on your oven. My cookies were perfect at exactly 16 minutes. Once you take the cookies out, let them rest until they're completely cooled off. As a decoration, you could sprinkle them with some powdered sugar to give them that snowy look and enjoy the cookies with your family. Thank you so much for watching and happy holidays from my family to yours.